Welcome back to Anderson Acres. I wanted to answer a question. It won't take long to answer, so this will be a fairly short video. But somebody asked me why I don't have any nesting boxes for my quail. I mean, that, I guess, is technically a nesting box, but it's really for chickens. Why don't I have some kind of basket or something for them to lay in? Well, let me tell you I did. I had cute little wicker baskets all done up with nice fluffy bedding, and they didn't use them. <laughs> They didn't care. I, I know some people have managed to get their quail to lay in a specific spot, like a basket or a box. Ah, uh, mine don't. I tried. I tried really, really hard. It just wasn't going to happen. I had a cute little wicker basket. I lined it with really nice fabric. I lined it with feathers. I li it had sand in the bottom. It was really nice. And I lined it with a bunch of different things, trying to get them to lay in it. Really, they dropped their eggs wherever they happened to be. They walk around, they drop their eggs. That's just what they do. So to answer the question, why don't I have nesting boxes? They don't use them. If you're lucky, maybe you'll have some that do. But don't expect your quail to use their nesting boxes. It's not going to happen. <laughs> They're going to lay wherever they happen to be. They'll wa be walking around and poop, there's an egg. <laughs> so... Don't be too distressed if you set up a bunch of nesting boxes and then your chickens, your quail, sorry, your quail don't lay in them. That's actually really normal. They tend to ignore them. Hi, sweetie. So it's okay to try nesting boxes or, nest, or nesting baskets as I tried, but it, don't get your hopes up. It's okay if the chicken or the quail, I keep saying chicken because there's a chicken behind me, but I keep saying... <laughs> Stop it. Sorry, there's a chicken pecking my leg. Anyway, it's okay to try to get your guys to lay in a box or a basket or whatever you want. Just don't be disappointed when they decide not to. Okay? That's kind of par for the course with quail. They're strange. They don't care. They just, you know, they're quail. Especially Cortunix quail. Some of the other types of quail do tend to go broody. These are Coturnix. Uh, they don't care. <laughs> they don't care. They don't care. They won't go broody. They're not going to hatch their chicks. They're not going to lay in a nest box. They're just not going to. So that's about it here at Anderson Acres for the day. We will come back tomorrow. Bye now.